Okay, I think we are live, guys. Hello, everyone. Hello, Cheryl. Hello, Deanna. How are you? Hello. Thank you for having me, inviting me. You are very welcome. I'm so glad you guys are here. We have some new guests. Um, what are you guys um, up to and what are you guys working on today? Well, I dug out some paper and I'm going to craft with you, Christian, today. Okay. So I have three I'm by 12. Three sheets of 12 by 12, yes. Um, what I'm doing tonight, and I'm going to write the instructions. It's very simple. This one is like um, like an embellishment book or something for a swap. It uses three sheets of 12 by 12 sheet of paper. Um, and once you open it, it has these pockets. And it's fun to decorate them. This you can add like flips onto it if you wanted to. Here's another pocket right here that you can put. Here's another pocket and here's another pocket right here. You see it? Hi, Pina, yeah, how are cute. you? It's cute, it's fun, and it's the easiest thing ever. It has so many pockets. And then this, the, this specific sides are the ones that you can put as photos if you wanted to. But imagine just three sheets of 12 by 12 goes a long, long way. Hi, Catherine. Welcome, welcome. So this is what we're going to be making today. I'm going to be writing our instructions so everybody can follow along. I think it's going to be fun. My post-it is super short and super tiny, so I don't think it's going to be easy. So if you guys want to join in, we're going to need the first sheet. So we're going to start with the outer portion. Okay. So three eights. So number one, number two, number three. So three sheets. And this number one, guys, this number one. This is the outer portion. This is the number one sheet. So go ahead and identify which is your first page, your second page, and your third page. Okay. Preferably this paper, I mean, you can use the single-sided paper if you wanted to, but it's better if you use a double-sided paper. Hi, Renee. Okay. One. So identify, identify your sheets of paper. The first sheet of paper, that's going to be your outside portion, okay? And the 12 by 12. So the width, you're going to score 5 and 5, 8. 6 and 3, 8. Okay. One, four. on both sides and then eight 12 by 12 on its wide side you're going to score a three eighths and five it, this is so easy like and it's so easy to do and it's perfect for swap oh my gosh hi christina hi deb how are you so i just wrote down instructions and this is what we're doing today this one and I hope you can see it. I hope like my phone has internet. Okay, it does. It says I have internet. Okay. So this is what we're doing. And it has these pockets. And if you want to, you can make this. You can make this into like for photos if you wanted to or something that you want to decorate. So I'm asking the girls, this is Cheryl and Deanna. Deanna's my roommate for the trip to Washington. Oh, Cheryl, Deanna's going to Washington too for the retreat in August. Awesome. Hi, Casey. I know. Awesome. Um, you guys are going to be able to meet each other. And this yeah. is your third page. Third page. It is so, bad. so My easy. phone is the way it is. That's okay. Flip it. That's a okay, guys. Okay. This is your first live. No big deal. Yeah. No big deal. Hi, Tracy. Hello, everyone. Thanks for hanging out with us. Um, 
Yes, we're all going to meet each other. It's going to be so amazing. <laughs> so excited. Um, okay, so we're going to identify. So I have my papers right here. I just need to identify which one is my first, second, and third page. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to start. So I think first, second, and third would be great. Okay. So don't, don't forget about your orientation. What is top, what is bottom, etc. Mm -hmm. Um, so I'm gonna go here. I'm just going to my YouTube studio to see content live. Okay. So I am just changing some stuff, guys. Get your uh, your scoreboard ready and your scoring tool ready. Okay. And that's what we're using. Okay. Do we need so I'm going to get my tool? scoreboard. Huh? Because uh, my, my scoreboard doesn't, well, it has a cutter, but I don't like it. So do I need my... No, uh, friend. Oh, okay. Perfect. No, you do not need it. Because we're going to fold... We're gonna fold uh, we're just going to, yeah, we're just going to yeah. score. To make um, you need, you awesome. need scissors, though. You need scissors. Oh, I got scissors. Yeah. Got plenty yeah, of those. Yeah, Deb and I are, are plain buddies. We're going to be, we're going to be plain mates. Hi, Edward. Edward, you're going to love this project. It's so easy and fun. Okay, so everybody, everyone, get your three sheets of paper if you're joining us. Three sheets of paper. So the first thing is, remember that the first sheet that we are scoring, that is your front page. So it's going to be this portion. Okay. So just be mindful of that. And that will be this one for me. Okay. So essentially, for example, this is your paper. The orientation is this is the top and this is the bottom. You're going to put it on its side and you're going to score at eight in uh, at eight. Let me see. Uh, no, not eight. Yes, it is oh. eight, but it's essentially like four inches from the bottom. Okay. I okay. hope that makes sense. So, so four I'm inches from the bottom. So you're going to score at the four inch side. Score and not cut. So my cows are going to go sideways. Yes. So, for example, this is your paper. It's going to go this side, and you're going to score at the four-inch mark. This big part right here, that's your eight inches. I hope that makes sense. Because that's going to make your pocket. Mm-hmm. That's going to make your pocket. It's so easy. So my it's so easy. Okay. So all of our three papers, you're going to score that way on the four-inch, okay. which is eight inches from, you know, does that make sense? So what I would do is I would do that right now for all three sheets because it's the same. Okay. So score on all of them on the right orientation. It's going to be easier. And some papers, it's easy if you're using, like, papers that don't have any orientation. Like, there's no top or bottom. It's all whatever side. Right. So now that we've done that, we've scored all of them. This is what it's going to look like, essentially. So this is my outside right here. That's what it's going to look like. And this is what it, it's going to be the inside. <coughs> so next. <coughs> Okay. Let me know when you're done scoring done. all at the four inch height. Hi, Vero. Okay, Hi, Nicole. <clears throat> so easy. The next is, so we're going to undo the folding right here. So it's going to be the entire 12 by 12. You're going to score at a 5 and 5, 8 and 6 and 3, 8. Five. 5 and 5, 8. And so my cows are now the right way right mm, yep yep your cows are standing up okay five, <coughs> five eights and six and three eight 
Okay. <clears throat> That's it. And then you burnish. <clears throat> That's your cover page. It is so fast. Oh my God, you guys, this is so fast. This is so cute. You're gonna love this because it is so easy. I'm not even kidding. Like you're done. Look at your cover. Isn't that so so quick and easy? We're gonna make two more and we're done. It's too fast. <laughs> That's very, it is easy. That's nice. It's we super like easy. easy. Right? <laughs> okay. I love easy. <clears throat> That's your first. So your cow page, um, Deanna, your cow is your cover. So you're going to set that aside. Okay. And then Cheryl's kite page, that yeah. she's going to set that aside. Yeah. Next, your, okay. your middle page. You're going to get your middle page. Okay. And since you've already, oh, um, Nicole, this is what we're making. We're making a, what do we call this book? Embellish it's an embellishment book. It's like a mini album. So let me show you what we have. So it has multiple pockets and multiple pages for photos right here. So for example, this is your photo. I'm going to get a picture. Let's say this is your, oh, sorry. of course, I grabbed the wrong photo. <clears throat> Let's say this is your picture. Let me find a picture of my, my kid and his best friend. So, for example, this is your photo right here. And then you can go have at it. You can add flaps if you wanted to. This could be, or you could do three by four. You can add that. But this is a pocket and a photo. This is two pockets. <clears throat> A pocket and a pocket and a photo page. So whatever you like to do with this, you can. And it's so so easy and fast. So we're on our page two, guys. Right? Page two. Yeah. We did the same already. We already did our four inch, right? Mm -hmm. And then don't forget to burnish that. Always use your bone folder because it makes sharp sharp. And then we're going to score the same five and five eighths again? Nope. Oh, oh. We're going to score at, okay, let me show you. We're going to put it on our paper. And this has more score marks, though. You're going to score okay. at one fourth, itty bitty one fourth from one fourth inch. Okay. Right there. And then you're going to score at five and three quarters. Hi, Pebbles. Five and three quarters. So I have a question. So the four mark is down at the bottom, correct? So this is the what? This is my four inch. Mark. Yes, that's correct. That's correct. And, and then you're I, scoring that way. And then now I'm scoring here at one fourth. Yep, that's correct. One fourth and five and three quarters. <clears throat> Edward has, has a question. I noticed your score cut board. How would you rate it? I cannot keep up with you, Robinson. This is the best I've ever had so far. It folds, it cuts, it scores. I this is my favorite of all. Um, I've had the the you know the multiple ones that has like the puncher and all that, but I this is the best. Fifty dollars I've ever spent on We Are Memory Keepers. I score it ten out of ten. What about you guys? Um, I have, mine's a Martha Stewart, so it's not. Uh, it's fine, but it doesn't. It has a cutter. See, I'll show you. Uh, oh wow! It has a cutter, but and then you slice down. But it, it it's it's not so great. I mean, it's all right. It works, but I usually don't. I usually don't cut with it. I just cut the, cut them separately. <clears throat> My cutter fell off like the first couple days I had it, and I never replaced it. So I just used it as a scoreboard, and I like it. I like mine too because it's so sharp. Okay, now we're gonna turn it upside down. Okay. And we're gonna do the exact same thing: one fourth oh. and five and three quarters. Okay. Okay. One fourth inch. And five and three fourths. 
and you're going to burnish. Hi, Chivis. Okay. Does it cut straight? I'm currently fighting to get straight cuts. Mine cuts straight. Yes. <clears throat> um, it, it, it is an amazing, for me, it's an amazing tool because I bring it to work. When you know the, the mere fact that it folds, yes, makes a huge yeah, difference. that's nice that it folds, that, that, that's right, nice. especially for crops. Because mm -hmm. the mini right. ones, the mini ones are good if you're only making cards, but right, if you're making big things like this, the mini ones aren't very good, so no, you won't be able to use it. Hi, Tamika, yeah. how are you? Welcome. So, we're we're doing our burnishing, guys. So even the itty bitty ones, you're gonna burnish. I'm a very slow craft. <laughs> Don't worry, friend. You're good. You're good. <clears throat> okay. So this is the second part. The third part, we're gonna do this. We're gonna do exactly, essentially the same, but different measurements. So let me know when you're done. Don't rush. It's gonna be okay. That's that like that, Cheryl. Just like that, you did it. Yeah, but can I put the flap? So what? The pocket. If it goes, oh no, then my raindrops. Will, no, my raindrops are right. Can I do it that way instead? It could be whatever you prefer, my yeah, friend. I think this way, I think I'll, I'm going to do it this way because I think then my flowers and my raindrops will be the correct direction. Right. <clears throat> because you're, you're kind of already seeing, right? We're going to put yeah. this on here. Yeah. It is so easy. Such an easy project, friend, yep. isn't it? Okay. Look how easy that is. Perfect. You guys are doing great. This one needs to be cut a little because it is not easy. <clears throat> I need to go find my bowl, my bone folder. It's in. I moved it. It's in a different room. And it's driving me nuts. You organize? Did you organize, Cheryl? No, I just, I, I've been crafting in different places in the house. So just, you know, like sometimes I'm tired of my crafting, so I bring it into the other room. <laughs> and now it's misplaced. Yeah, yeah, it's misplaced. Sometimes I craft in the living room, too. Yeah. So if the kids want to watch, like, you know, a movie or whatever. I'm have, still doing something. <clears throat> I have three bone folders. And do you think any of... Oh, wait. I found one. Yes, oh, you did. I Yay. found one. <laughs> I was like, you think one of them could be in the right place, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let me know when you guys are ready. And that's page two. It's so super easy. It just magically works so fast. <clears throat> Just with three okay, sheets, I feel like you get like a six page embellishment. Okay. So we are working on our third page, which is the last page. Okay. okay. This one okay. doesn't matter. This one. So it's the same on the bottom. The bottom is still your your four your yes. four inch, right? Okay. And Make sure that you burnish that really good. Okay. Four inches. And then after that, you're going to undo your folds and you're going to have it straight, standing up straight upright. This time, you're going to score it at three eighths and five and seven eighths on both sides, like what we did earlier. Okay. So three eighths of an inch, which is like one, two, three on, on the third, and then yeah. five and seven eighths. Which That's is the tick mark before your six. Right. So three, it's a little bit wider, but a little bit narrower in the middle. Okay. Okay. So you're going to do that. You're going to turn it around and do the same exact thing. Exactly the same. Three eighths. And 
five and seven eighths. And you're done. All right. I'm going to set aside my um, scoreboard. And I'm going to start burnishing. You can determine which side you prefer. It's up to you. It's normally determined by the orientation of your paper. Like how, you know, like if you're using like a rainbow or a heart, you know, you don't want your heart upside down or your rainbow upside down or your cow in, your, in um, Deanna's case. Mm -hmm. Right. So you want your cow standing on its feet. And the fun part is you have so many pages to decorate. That's the best part. <clears throat> That's your last page. All done. All of it is done and it's so easy. That's it. So what are we doing with the little edges that we scored on the edge? The are little edges, my down, friend. Or? Okay. So let me let me show you what I'm the okay. little edges that could be reinforcement if you want. Hi Soph, uh -huh. how are you? What I'm doing, here's what I'm doing for the edges. I'm I'm folding it like this. If you can see, I'm folding it like this, and then I am just doing a tab. You're just doing a tab, essentially. You see that? You see that right there? No, not really. Like a little knot? Yeah. <clears throat> you see, I just cut like a V there in okay. between. Okay. And so and you... this one is going to be a pocket. That's for the four inch part. That's going to be your pocket. So that's going to hold it together. Okay, yeah, yeah. And then this portion right here, if yeah. you want to add something, for example, you want to add a flap. Oh, if you okay. want to add more pages, you can, yeah. like a flip. That's your yeah. chance if you want to. If you don't, you can just attach it onto here and glue it onto itself. Yeah. And that's okay. going to be a reinforcement. So it's up to you. What I did for my samples, I just glued it onto itself. Yeah. I didn't do any kind of flap yeah. or flip, see? Okay. But you it's could, not. Yeah. But you can if you want to. That's the thing. You see, this one is just made as reinforcement. But if you feel like, oh, I want more pages because, you know, I'm using this for like day one, two, and three, and I have so many pictures for this trip, you can. Okay. So that's the flexibility of, that's a flexibility of this project. And you just essentially just like, you know, glue it or the easier yeah. way is to just use your double-sided tape and just glue it. I, what I like doing is I like to put it right here in the middle to secure it. Right, what do you guys think? Isn't that super easy? I think yeah. it looks better to put my kites on the inside because then they, they're not upside down on this page. That looks they, you know, great. I can put the yeah. That looks better. Pad on the outside, yeah. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so what I want to do, you can use you can use those as reinforcements if you want to, but okay. I'm gonna be a little bit. I'm gonna be a little bit. Um, I'm gonna be doing a little bit of creative business, so I'm gonna use it as a flap. If you have a lot of paper, you can. If you want more pages, you can. That's up to you. But if you want to be like, oh, I'm, I'm done. I'm already, I'm good with six pages. Then you stop and just create as reinforcement. Mm -hmm. You glue it onto itself. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Then this one, I'm adding like a strip of like double-sided tape. Because I'm going to glue that to the friend. The second part. That makes sense. So here, I'm cutting this right here. It's the easiest, easiest eight by six mini album you would ever make. So 
so so easy. So now you're putting double-sided tape on the the spine of the smallest one. Is that what you're doing? Mm-hmm. To glue it to the the next page, right? Yep. That part I get. Understand. That, that part part's super easy. Yeah. Super easy, super fun. I mean, imagine oh, we are we've been live for 25 minutes and we're done actually. <laughs> we're just putting it together. That's that's the easiest project ever. So do you want should we be gluing down our, our uh, pockets? Or I am gluing my pocket. <clears throat> yeah. yeah, I'm sticking it down. Yeah. If that would make sense. Yeah. So again, if you don't want to do any kind of more of the flips, <clears throat> attach this onto itself, or you can cut it if you want to. If you don't want that flap, if it messes you up like, oh my God, it's not the same paper, you can cut it off if you want to. Up to you. Like you can cut this if you don't like it. I'm going to use it as <clears throat> another layer to add some flips to my book. That's why I'm not touching it just yet. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But that's super easy. Super easy. 30 minute project, essentially. Super quick. This is like a project that you do if you just want if you just want to play with paper and you don't have a lot of time. Like, I don't have a lot of time to invest, but I want to play. <clears throat> this is going to be a great project. Or something to do with the, with the grandkids, the, the family, some friends that are not crafty. This would be a good segue for them. So the last, co the cover page, I am, you know, the pocket, I'm just adding, <clears throat> I'm just adding the, because there's no flap to this. So I'm just adding the double-sided tape on the side, just like this one. And then gluing it. Okay. Da -da 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 -da. Pocket. Now I can stick this one to this one. <clears throat> this one is not symmetrical, but that's okay. Hi, Gina. How are you? We're making a kind of like a happy mail situation using three sheets of 12 by 12. I'm going to show you the prototype. It has pockets <clears throat> and it takes no time at all. No time at all. And this is the measurement. So this is this is the original prototype that I used some scrap pieces of paper. And it has a pocket, a space for photos like here. And then another pocket right here to put goodies. And then another space for photos. Another photo. Another another pocket, pocket or photo if you want. And then here's another photo place and a pocket. Another photo and a pocket. Super easy. Three sheets of 12 by 12. There's nothing to it. And these, if you guys want to do a screenshot, this is our measurements. So this is essentially your cover page. That's your cover. And this is next and then next. <clears throat> How are we doing, guys? How are we doing with our projects? I think good. Good. Yeah, I think We're so. on the right track. Easy peasy so far.
And then you just add your odds and ends and you're, you're in business, mm -hmm. essentially. Right? So fun. Especially if you have the like, coordinating products. Done. This is done. If I decide I don't want to do any flips, like, and I can just cut this off. Or if I want to add additional pages, I could. But it's it's your it's your decision whatever you prefer i'm gonna get some embellishment oh let's get some <clears throat> cute embellishments right here let's see i think a doily is in order i feel like a doily is always in order a doily would be cute. Very cute. A doily would be so much fun, especially if you have something really, really bright. Mm -hmm. That can balance it out, you know? And then you can add a title, whatever you like. Okay, there's my second one. Okay. Cute. Mm -hmm. Cute, easy. Cute, cute, cute. Okay. And the last page. Super easy, super fun. I'm listening. I'm making an 8x8 eight eight album base. How fun, Deb. I love mini albums. Mini albums give me so much joy. I went to this I went to the nail salon today before this live. Oh, it's top secret. I'm excited, Gina. The top secretness of it. Um did you guys did you guys uh does your salon offer you like Chardonnay or wine? Oh no. no. My salon does. Wow. And they're like, would you like something to drink? So they have like a menu of like soda juice they give you you can have uh, on the list there's a mimosa cookies you have to buy it? no no it's complimentary oh wow. wow, i'm coming to get yeah, come get your nails at my salon girl i'm like okay I, i'll get chardonnay <laughs> why not <laughs> right. Right. what i was my like hair, my haircut and, and um i'm getting low lights tomorrow so Ooh, i'm excited fabulous fabulous time. Since I got my hair done, so that's gonna be so fabulous, Cheryl. You're gonna yes. feel so absolutely fabulous. Yes. I always do yes. after a haircut, you know. Yes, I'm so excited. Or some like hair business. You feel yeah. that's I think that's a purpose of doing that is to make you feel fabulosity. Yeah. I I actually go my hairdresser lives in California. Oh, no way. Wow. Yes. He charges a third of the price here in Washington, and she works a mile away from my son's house. So I'm like, uh, I need to go visit my son, to get my hair done. Right. <laughs> it's, my it's a lot of stones. I mean, I get a plane ticket and my hair done for the same price. There Can't, you go. Yeah. Wow. And you get to visit your grandson. Uh, you, you you get to visit your son as well. Yeah. No grandkids. I don't think I'll ever be a grandma, but that's okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm wondering that myself on my side. Yeah. You know, the kids these days, they don't want to bring kids into the world. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> So, and I'm, I'm the type of person that doesn't hurt my kids. It's like they're grown boys. They, mm -hmm. you know, if they want kids, if yeah, they want it, don't support. Want to pressure them. Yeah. Exactly. Yep. Agreed. Of course, I have grandkids, but that's not my choice. If it's not in the cards, you know. Exactly. Oh. You just have to find somebody else who has them and then just, you know, get your baby. Adopt. Kids, you know, off of that. 
Yes, I have a dog nephew. I could spoil that baby and him. Yep. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yep. Okay. So, I think I think I have it, except for my uh, a flap or whatever. I'm now I'm gonna look at the rest of the paper and see what I might want to do. Gina said, "Can you blame them?" I know it's like I feel like that's gonna happen to me too when my kids are ready mm -hmm. and of age, because my kids are 15 and 12, so at uh, 13, so 15, 16. 15 going on 16 this year and I feel like they're young but I don't I wouldn't blame them if they feel that it's not in the cards for them like I totally totally get it you know right right okay I am I have my front page <clears throat> planned out I gave my parents six grandkids oh I gave my mom two. Two is all I could do with a C-section. It feels so weird getting my nails like done. You know, I had them, you know, the artificial one that has powder. It takes, I tried to remove it last night. Oh my God. I'm like, no, I need professional help. This is not working oh, out. Oh no. It is so, so let's, hard let's to remove. Let's see your new ones. Let's see the color. No, I, I just got them removed. Oh, oh, that's all you did. You didn't. Uh, didn't no, get no. Ones on. Okay. No, I want them to rest because I feel like. Yeah. It's been through because it's my first time doing that artificial yeah. acrylic nails. Mm -hmm. And I feel like that was in an intense experience for my nails right now. So I'm like, I'm going to give you a rest, and we'll go from there. I love getting my nails done. But going to the salon is a little of an experience for me, so it is not something I would be doing again. Because mm -hmm. making an appointment, like my salon is so popular, you guys, that you cannot walk in. Walk in is not an option ever. Wow because they're so packed and they said like give it a week give us a week notice i'm just grateful that they had an opening today because i walked in and they're like oh nope you have to come back like 5 45. that i i think it's because you know they give good service you get wine you get mimosa like when where have i you ever seen a salon giving you wine or you know champagne or whatever that's, never. that's, a, that's definitely a twist i've never i haven't heard of that so i can right? imagine that that's causing them you know to be busier i mean i can only imagine yeah deb said deb said that i went to a um uh, she said that she is allergic to all the products mm. That's Hello, Mrs. Coop. Hello, how are you? PT exercising, watch, watching you gals. Um, Deanna, Deanna, Renee is asking, is that a cow dye? Yes. Oh, my God. It is so cute. I was just going to get some paper. Look at that dye. Absolutely adorable. And it's cottage cuts. Yes. So you can cut out the cow and make it want. I have just been dying for like some farm animal stuff and the pig. Okay, so, so I think I know Miss Cooper's coop. <laughs> Muriel. Do you, do you go to the crafty, oh, what's it called? Um, the Wild Woman Weekends with, because uh, I know her from there. I'm pretty sure it's the same person. This is Cheryl. I've been there before. It's Muriel. Muriel, do you know G? Muriel. Do you know Cheryl? She knows me. Hopefully, she remembers me. She said, "Yes, I have." Yeah, I've been there with. They closed the place where we we go. There's a great 
place, but they closed. I think she sold it, closed it. Is it a scrapbook store or? No, it's a it's a house that she would. Uh, it has lots of bedrooms, and you could have like a min a little retreat there. You could, and they they would. Uh, it had like six or seven bedrooms, so and with many beds in each one, so you could have like sixteen people. And oh my goodness! All your craft tables set up and. Uh, we would share like in the meals for cooking. So like you'd just be responsible for one meal. And share oh my the, goodness, we had the most the most fun, huh, Muriel? She said she's sad. Muriel said yes, they did. So sad. I know. Muriel makes beautiful things. <laughs> Muriel, Muriel, um, and it's what a small <laughs> world. Now you're seeing each other online. I know. It's, it's fun. <laughs> I love it. How cute. It is so easy. My goodness. I just. I am so just there's loving. another person that can join our, our uh there you go over here. We'll that's here that's the party. Washington delegation, Deanna. Is yeah. Muriel from Washington too? Yep. Another delegate. Welcome, Muriel. Yeah. <laughs> Christian, I've been to Joanne three times, thanks to you. <laughs> <laughs> you are very welcome, my friend. Now you get a lot of lots of beautiful, beautifulness in your craft room. Thank you. Thank you for going to Joanne's. Did you guys know the 99 cent store is gonna close? Which one? All of them, 99 cents. <laughs> well, our, ours is a dollar to here, and it's not 99 cents, it's $1.25. Yeah, it's a dollar 25, so that's different. Yeah. The 99, the actual 99 cent oh. store, with yeah, goodies, yeah. that's 99 cents, is closing. Oh, bummer. I don't know if we have that here. Oh, you don't it's have it in here. Washington? Yeah, we not have, near me. We have the Dollar Tree here. Yeah. Yes, the Dollar Tree is alive and kicking. Yeah, yeah but they're going to go up to $7. Like they're No way! Yeah. Like how? Items. Like, you know how they have the dollar five to three dollars. Yeah. Now it's gonna go up to seven dollars. Oh my jeez! And mine doesn't carry the extra, the big items. Either I don't, mine. Yeah, I don't. Uh, my goodness. I mean, there's plenty. I could find one. There's plenty of them around. It's just that I How do we keep up with the inflation business, guys? I know. What's the plan there? What's how? How do we? Only California, Texas, Arizona, and Nevada. Gene, I almost died when I saw your Maggie Holmes D stash you got. Um, Nicole said that she doesn't have ninety nine cent store. They're only in California, Texas, Arizona, and Nevada. Yeah, when I go visit my I sister in California, I can go there. Okay, I look, love the night. Flaps now. You see that? That's cute. I love it. Yeah, oh, so that's super. my inside so far, anyway. I love it. I love it. I'm going to make mine like a big one. So let me get my cutter. I love it for pictures. I do have this one. Hello, time, but I'm gonna have to cut it down. Maybe this I will. This one is. Let me eight, measure that. Measure eight measure. inches. Hello, Ebony. How are you? My Dollar Tree manager told me all the non-brand items will say 125 brand name items will be 150 to dollar 75 and oh then plus word. items wow no wow 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 wowzers that's intense well, i guess they're losing money i mean that's they they have to be losing money i guess they wouldn't do that otherwise man that's like 
how do you keep up with all of this honestly hi ebony how are you you can't because not only does dollar tree go up your grocery stores your gas everything everything mm -hmm. your water bill everything 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 honestly everything but like, how do you keep up you can't you can't anymore everything i am adding some so this is my additional page I am so okay. happy to make a cow and a pig because they are so stinking cute. I love those. They are cute. They are so adorable. They're time consuming, but once you get a pattern down, mm -hmm. pretty fast. Once those? you get your groove on. The cottage cuts. Oh, yes. Cottage cuts. Those are awesome. They're so cute. They are so, so darn cute. I grew up in a cowboy town, and so farm anything is just so my heart. Oh, I'm going to have to see what you got. Oh, Maggie Holmes. Look, look, they're closing all family dollars too. So looks like Dollar Tree is the lone survivor. I I thought I heard there was some Dollar Tree, but no. I try to avoid the news because of negative. The did you guys see? Did you guys hear that Joanne's was claiming bankruptcy? Yes. Yeah. So I'm just thinking, oh, I hope they don't close. <laughs> Like, oh, I'm gonna be so sad. I know. I'm gonna be so sad because Michael is barely Michael's is barely selling anything good enough. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Yeah, Hobby Lobby went way down on what their crappy items are. Yeah, Hobby Lobby wants to be a furniture store or something. Yeah. Yeah. Like it has an identity crisis. Right. Gina says six hundred plus family dollars. $30 trees and 99 cents only all. Oh my goodness. That's so insane. Is it because of inflation, you guys think? Do you think it's because yeah. of in the inflation? Well, I think so, partly. I mean, the, the, it costs them more to get the products now, you know? Wow. And I think the there's so much uh, presence on the internet that people are yeah. buying online and then they're, they're not buying aliexpress it. yeah so Timu. Uh, Timu. yep so then they people uh don't necessarily they don't get enough business i guess is that's the true part of it and then the cost you know of everything is going up somewhat so yep and from the consumer standpoint of course they want something that's more cost effective it's this if it's the same product right mm -hmm. as okay. as consumers like us you know right i feel like you want to get the most bang for your money because of inflation No, and and here because of the retreat we're going to, I have all the money for that. Sorry, it was no. choppy. What did you say, friend? I'm on a no spend. Screen. Oh no, spend. Yeah. Just so I have money for the and I. It and know that I really earned it. That makes sense. I'm Absolutely. 
I'm going to do a garage sale before in the summer before the retreat and use my, the garage sale money for a retreat. Oh, that's a great idea. Yeah. And great idea. Up, you know, and then, yeah. What I'm going to do. But uh, are sessions. you driving? Are you driving? Um, I forgot. Uh, Deanna. 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 Are you no. Deanna? No. no, I'm actually going to fly out of sea. Okay. Path, and I'm on okay. this. I'm on the same plane as Mimi um, because I only drive local um, mm -hmm. because our traffic is so crazy. I know it is. I, I drove last year, but I, I haven't. I'm pretty sure I'm going to drive again, but we'll see. Um, if I would have known that, I would have been with you and split split the cost but mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. we bought our ticket i think way back in yeah that's okay. yeah yeah next year maybe right yeah do you guys live close to each other um about an hour renton yeah. is an hour mm -hmm. yeah it's not too bad <laughs> on what it depends on rush hour traffic or <laughs> right exactly <laughs> What time of the day are you going to go? And Lake Stevens, I'll tell you, where I live has grown so huge that it takes a course to get anywhere, just in town. Oh, my. It was just a small little town, and now we're huge. Let me read the comments real quick. Joe Ann's, um, Al, so Ali Timushin are going to take over our crafty world. Joe Ann did file bankruptcy, but they're under protection, so they will not close. Online is killing the brick and mortar. China is going to take over our country. Wait and see. We are shooting ourselves in the foot because now all of these people are out of work. That's so true. It is um, so China, true. Right? It's so true. China is waiting for our politicians to take us out and their country will swoop in. Deanna, what is blocking your screen? What is half that? half of your is, uh, a light? is that a light? It's in the upper left corner. Oh, my screen. light might have I probably went uh, I don't know if I can play it. So half of your screen <laughs> is showing um muriel said cheryl what is the name of your channel it's cheryl's amazing oh. crafts yeah and it i have a youtube i need i i'm begging anybody to go subscribe to my youtube channel because i don't have very many subscribers right now <laughs> i don't have much posted out there oh well, i'll check you out i'm i also have a i'll YouTube. follow i followed you yeah, you did. And Deanna, you. what is your channel? Crafty Ho Girl. And I would love Crafty Ho Girl. Yeah. Please, please, please follow our friends, guys. Yeah. Following and supporting is free. That way we can post more and, and people oh, yeah. will actually see it. <laughs> yeah, I love to support my friends and crafters. Um, mm -hmm. So definitely Thank you for subscribing, oh. guys. Oh, and I have the same thing, uh, Cheryl's Amazing Crafts on Instagram. I post more on Instagram. Renee said she'll subscribe. Muriel Yay. said, um, just she's gonna check. So please, Good. if you are able to follow my friends Cheryl and Deanna, they would love for you to hang out at their channel. That would be so so fun. Yeah. And Deanna, after, after we get off, I'll I'll go subscribe to yours. Okay. Crafty I'll, whole girl. Yeah, yeah, I'll check you out as well. Okay. Uh, let's do I, the same for each other, you guys. Because this community, let's support each other. Let's mm -hmm. let's help each other out. And you know, that's the better, that's the better side is to support each other and have fun together because we can all succeed together, right? That's, that's what it's all about. Yeah, right, thanks. right now, I haven't had the crafting time that I want 
because I shared with Christian that my husband is pretty burned out at work after 35 years at Boeing. And we, on April 15th, are trying to, um, it's going to be on an agenda to get a private piece of property in California. And so we would like to relocate down to Southern California and be closer to our son. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And so I've been busy packing up everything, getting rid of everything to Goodwill and just preparing that it's a small little community where um, 75% of the owners have to um, agree to sell the property. And it's just a little community and it's gorgeous. I'm excited for you. I'm excited for yeah, you. That that's Deanna's fun. channel, you guys. That's her link. If you don't mind subscribing, that would be awesome. Um, Gina cannot find yours. Cheryl, is it the one word only? Cheryl? Yeah, and craft? it's all it's all lowercase, I believe. It's all lowercase, Gina. And Pebble said she is in the Midwest. And she is going to be flying from O'Hare. 1.5 hours from O'Hare. Yeah, um, Nicole said, I'm 45 minutes to one hour from O'Hare. Ooh. Oh, wow. I can see, I can see a PHA Chicago delegation coming from there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Looks like we're forming a delegation. So I have a Washington delegation, which is Muriel, Cheryl, and Deanna. And then looks like Pebbles and Nicole will be forming the Chicago delegation of PHA. How fun is that? So much fun. Yay. I love having local friends. I do. It's so fun. And I do have a Colorado delegation as well, which <laughs> is so fun and renee so if you guys are traveling to chicago you can craft your crafty friends in chicago if you're going to colorado you can craft with your colorado pha members oh my god so so fun <laughs> if you're in sacramento of course craft with us <laughs> that's amazing do you remember, Christian, when we did it, did we put the apostrophe? I don't think we did. I think it just is Cheryl's amazing craft. Huh. She said, Cheryl's Gina amazing said crafts. she can't find it. Huh. I, I'm using both of my, uh, my devices right now, so I can't look. Uh, let me try to look. Um, Gina said she's all alone in Nevada. So if anybody is in Nevada, yeah. please give a shout out to Gina. She wants a crafty delegation from Nevada. Yes. That would Eileen's be coming from Colorado? Eileen is going to Colorado? Renee? So? Is that true? Cheryl's amazing crafts let me type is that true cheryl did you do cheryl's paper creations or that's not you no 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 cheryl if you search for um it's hard to find you uh, search for on youtube for a ks crafts like uh august uh release i did i think it was the august or september i did a, a youtube video on that all the dies i also did a doodle bug haul on on one of them uh i can't remember what doodle bug uh collection it was uh, look at this cow isn't he so cute lot. already Oh, I love it. I love the I love the udders. Yeah. So cute. Lots of little pieces, huh? <laughs> oh my god. Yep. She is moving to Colorado. How amazing. Oh, Melissa is in Nevada. 
Gina. Yeah, Melissa's. Melissa is in Vegas, I yeah. think. R Gina is in Reno. Yes. I, I got my honeymoon was in. I think I need to. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. So I think I, think I need our... to change my name because uh -huh. can find we can't me. find you, Cheryl. That's not a good thing. That is not, it's going to be very difficult for people to find you if we can't find you by your name. Yeah, yeah. That's my suggestion. I need Weezer. I'm going to have to work on that, especially before I get more people because. Yeah. What part of Colorado? Hi, Sassy. How are you? Tried Doodlebug Hall and KS Crafts. She tried Doodlebug Hall and KS Crafts and nothing. Nothing. Yeah. Here, I'll look on my iPad. And see yeah, look and then let us know how to find you because we want to support you, friend. Mm -hmm. Um, Crafty Hogue Girl is easy to find. I wonder where, which part, I wonder which part of um, Colorado she will be moving towards. That will be insane if Brene and Soph and um, Eileen is in one area. Oh my God. We have a Colorado de uh, delegation. Okay, so it's Oh, I see what we did. So it's capital C H E R Y L S, capital A, M A Z, uh, and then capital C. So Cheryl's amazing crafts, but you have to capitalize each word. Capitalize each word. Okay. Capital. But, because, okay, capital. Capital C and then. Capital A, capital A, a and capital C. C. Yeah. Okay, let me try. But that is that is probably going to be hard for people. Oh, oh, oh my God. I capitalized it. And it's still showing somebody else. Paper and twine. Um, so can, can I, I can copy the link and stick it in the thing, right? Yes, absolutely. That will be that will be great if you did. It's showing somebody else, friend. Mm -hmm. hmm. That's weird. I see Cheryl's paper creations. I don't think that's yeah, her. Think... She's like Cheryl's cra no. amazing crafts. Uh, Someday when I'm retired, I'll start YouTube again. Yes, start YouTube. Her husband is in the military. I don't think he's retired yet. Yeah, I have two whole videos and four subscribers. <laughs> I love it. I think I'm one of them, Cheryl. I know. <laughs> I just, and my sister's one of them. <laughs> you got to start somewhere. I know. <laughs> yep. It's, it's Better than funny. zero. It's very funny. Yeah. Uh, 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 okay, you guys, I just stuck it in. <laughs> Hopefully that works. Let me know if that works for people. <laughs> did it? It didn't glue it. Where did you put it? In the live in the live chat. Is it, Is it there? there? Okay. okay. Maybe. I'm a little bit behind, delayed, so that might be part of the problem. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if I could Colorado use. Space. I don't that. see it either. I don't see your your comment, Cheryl. You don't? Mm -mm. It should be automatic. Well, the, well, that's bizarre. It's uh, I see it on my side. <laughs> um. Hmm. Where? I 
see it. But it's not a, yeah, actually, let me see. Yeah. I'm going to click on that. Click on it. Yeah, click enter, enter, maybe. I click did. Click enter. I did. <clears throat> I, I can see it in myself, but I don't know why you guys can't see it. See, look. Can you see right there? Wait, let me give you a solo layout. I'm way behind How come it's you not guys. Showing? I don't know why. I don't know why I'm way. Oh, there we go. See, I, it's right there. That's the one I put. But it's... Uh, It's, it's very delayed for me, so I can't even figure out how to show you guys. See, see Cheryl Jones right there? But I Is your channel that. private, friend? I don't think so. Let me go They're back asking if it's private because okay. we won't be back. able to see it if it's private. Let me go back to it. Uh, let me go home. Let me close this one out. For That's me. true, huh? That's uh, true. You won't be able to see it if it has a private uh, settings. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me see. I thought we set it up last last year, so that uh, let me check it out. Uh, let me go check it out. Join. Hi, Cheryl P. How are you? Twenty three views. Uh, I have. Let's make that Deb. Let's make that more. My channels. Uh, Put your link, Deb. Plus shorts. Cheryl, what is your logo? <clears throat> what is my my logo? Mm -hmm. My my little icon thing. It's a blue yes. with a like a, a dove, a yellow dove. Blue with a yellow dove. Gina is a private investigator. She will find you. <laughs> That's uh, on YouTube. That's what it is. Um, how do I know if my thing is private? Uh, let's see. It says more about this channel. Let's see. Uh, Just piping to say I found Cheryl's channel and subscribed. Cheryl P, can you please send us a link? Hi, Gina number two. Yeah, I have five subscribers now. Woohoo! <laughs> one, one more. Yeah. <laughs> and I'll, I promise I'll post more. Uh, How do I? There's, there's Deb's link, you guys, hmm. to her channel. Follow that. Where is Cheryl's? I can't find it either. Yeah, that's hard. right. I, Gina is a private investigator. If she cannot find it, let's see. Tell me if you guys can see this. Once I, that's my. You can see my logo there. We can't see it. We all we see is time. There you go. And then, so it's a I blue go, Cheryl's yeah. name on and YouTube. If I go back, it's like session. that. Cheryl's amazing crafts. You posted her link. Okay, let me go. It says privacy. There. Keep all my subscriptions private. Is that why? Yes. Okay, let me, how do I move, change that? Cause Make it public. Know. And this, uh, thank you, thank you. This is her channel, okay. Cheryl's Amazing Crafts. Make it public. Ah, there we go. Your changes were saved. Keep all my subscriptions. No spaces. Change me to your profile. Pictures are visible only, only on YouTube and not on Coupon S3. Privacy. Okay, let me go. Back. Now we can find you. Okay, privacy. Cheryl's. Amazing. Crafts. Yeah, it's not. It's find not. Find the private. dove. Find the dove. 
Where's the dough? Yeah, I need to get a picture of myself in there or something, but for now, I... Did you click it as effective, well, as, I, as effective now? It was, it was uh, unchecked. The privacy thing was unchecked, so it should have been public. I, I think I made it private for a second, but now I made it back again, public. It's not coming up for me either. Let's see if it lets me copy a link from here. Copied. Okay. Let me try this again. The link Cheryl posted above says pretty paper obsession. Wow. Uh, uh, Gina, this is Tamika I found and posted her link. Where is it, I wonder? Tamika, I need to make you, I think, a moderator uh -huh. for it to show up. Oh, Mi Muriel just found me, but I don't... Now, I just posted it again, but I don't know how to do links, so I don't know if the what I posted is... There you are. Gee, that's... I got to change that because there's no way people are going to figure me out if it, it can't even get to me. Mm -hmm. Cheryl's Amazing Crafts. There you go. Now we can copy that. Oh. Look. I just found her. Okay, perfect. You should be able to share your link. That's true. Perfect. Perfect chills, amazing crafts. Find the bird. And there's no Start. correct. What is it? No faces. No face. It's just a bird. The the bird. Yes, blue background with a bird. Okay, but there's and no the dove with. Cheryl's amazing crafts, correct? No spaces, yeah, but no space. Capital C, capital A, and capital C for crafts. On the rest are all lowercase. I, I think I'm gonna make a change with that though because it's just too. Uh, so many confusing. Cheryls. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah, make it a, a like a different name. I cannot find it. I can't find it. Yeah, that's that's not good. That's yeah. No good. I wonder why. I wonder why. I typed it. Do I put an apostrophe? Is there an apostrophe? Uh I believe not. Okay, I don't so I'm gonna put her name with the bird. There's no pause to do after uh, for Cheryl's after the uh, Cheryl. There, I'm subscribed already, Cheryl Jones. Yeah, yeah, I knew you were. Eleven subscribers now. <laughs> I, I put Cheryl's amazing crafts on YouTube search bar yeah. just like that, and it came up. Oh my gosh, how come it's not? It, so I've already subscribed. Okay, I feel much better. I just need to okay, post good. more often. That's for sure. Very yes. good. Thank you so much, you guys. Thank yes, you so much. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Ross, huh. That is. Share her link. Oh yeah. Okay. Let me let me get her link. Uh, <laughs> copy. That is the link. How are we doing with our books, guys? I think I'm, I'm almost getting my cow. I'm getting there. Look at your cow. I'm going to give you a solo. I'm going to give you a solo layout on your cow. Look how cute is your cow. I got to find his tail. I mean, these. 
pieces are so tiny. Oh, I love it. No, they're so cute. It's so tiny. Oh my god. But check him out. Like in this embellishment book, I can make like a farm animal. Yes. Wait, are we allowed to do them? You can have them all hanging out over there. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Renee said, make 12. <laughs> <laughs> but once you get, I haven't cut this out in probably a year or so. And then um, I do have some of the distress ink that I could put on them. That would be so cute. That would be so adorable. And then, because the you can't be a perfect cow. Super cool. And then the piggy, he could hang out with the pig. The pig. Hi, Lamont. Renee said, "Love her. I need that die in my life." Deb said, "That cow is adorable." It is so stinking cute. And <laughs> Deb, uh, Gina said, "Dang, what a mess!" I finally subscribed. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Edward is asking, "Is that?" Paper cow, paper doodle bug. Yes, it is, Edward. It it's is fabulous, and you need it in your life. Yes. So there's a the, chisel. Look at, and then look at the inside. Voila! I love the cow print. So cute. And that's all doodle bug. I love doodle bug. We were me and Diana were talking yesterday. We talked for hours. And when I started, nobody liked Rubug. And then we finally found each other, like the Doodle Bug lovers. Yes. It's now. Love. Oh my God, this is turning out so cute. It's so fun to decorate, you guys. So fun. So cute. Oh, so cute. Um, oh, Lamont is here. Hi, Lamont. We are making these books that are super easy to make. Many moons ago, I had a cow collection, probably five, over 500, sold it all. What? 500. Man. Gina, you just jumped. Uh, Cheryl, you just jumped to 16 subs. Woohoo! Thank you. <laughs> Hey, Lamont, now you're another to... dude crafter, I suppose. <laughs> now I need to post, right? <laughs> now you need to post. Now you have 16 yeah. people waiting for you, friend. Yeah. Okay, so um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show my... Uh, let me see. Where is my... Okay. Let me show my... I'm going to do a solo really quick. This is my book. So, Lamont, to answer your question, this is what we're making. And this is a measurement. It's the easiest thing. It takes 25 minutes to create. And, of course, you can go to town kind of decorating it however you prefer. But this is the easiest. So, take the opportunity. If you want to do a screenshot, go for it. But, essentially, we're just folding paper and making pockets and attaching it onto each other. Um, so this is what I made right here, and look how cute it is. I did flips. I added some flips. This is a pocket, um, and then this is a flip right here for extra photos, extra pictures, what have you, right there if you wanted to. And then you can add a photo right here. This is like a tucked spot right here super fun the easiest thing ever in the world this one i haven't decorated i can just put a simple fairy right there and call it but look how fast that is and then this one is you know like a something you open up if you wanted to and a hedgehog and then this one is also a tough spot if you want to add some photos right here you can um, because of past jobs, I haven't done any crafting for now. I'm trying to get back to get back into the crafting business. So much fun. And then if you want, you can add photos. You can do whatever you want in those pockets. Here's another top spot for photos or whatever. More pages. I think the flips really makes makes it exponentially, you know, the real estate. It does make it exponential. 
I'm going to go now to Cheryl. I'm going to go to you now. Okay. And I'm going to show us your, show us your album. So that's my front cover. So cute. Got a little butterfly up here and the little deer there or fawn or whatever. Make and it then, lower, Fred, so we can see your, the entire page. Yeah, right oh, there. Yeah. And then oh, the, uh, darling. So then, cute. I love the deer. <laughs> yeah, that's a pocket there. I put a little banner here. And then this page, I have this flap. And then I'm just working on, I haven't finished this side yet, but put two flaps here. So cute. Isn't it so easy? It is easy. And then I put another flap on this side and then that's it. Another pocket. Yeah. It's like pockets and flaps and whatever mm -hmm. you want it to be. Whatever you want it to be. Deanna, can I see your book? Yes, it's... I'm going to give you a big solo layout. I love the cow. It's still in progress. I want to mm -hmm. order the ephemera to go with this collection. Um, mm -hmm. So, but there's the front cover. And I still haven't glued them down yet because I'm not sure what I want to, what order and stuff. Well, it's going to go red and then the aqua, but... Then here, and I do have the pocket. Mm -hmm. So if you so can cute. see there's po polka dots. And this. Oh, that's cute. So cute. So cute. Love it. I, I feel like that's an easy, easy project to make, don't you think? Oh, it's so easy. So easy, so cute. And I didn't, I left this and I might laminate the front cover um, because I've already done my folds. I might be able to laminate it, but I don't know if the laminator does 12 by 12. I don't think it does. Mm -mm. And that's the why I- The was 11 and three quarters for mine. Yeah. So I'll thank you for the link. That's Deanna's channel, guys. If you want to follow and subscribe, mm -hmm. that will be awesome. Please, please, please. please. Thank you. Hi, Stace. Port. Mm -hmm. Love the cows. They're so cute. Oh, my gosh. Well, we have property here in Washington State, and it's our hunting property. And the cows roam free, and it gives you a right off. And we have so much fun with the cows, just chasing them around and naming them and mooing at them. And so <laughs> we kind of get us cows. She's not so funny. <laughs> Such an easy, easy project. I feel like you can, this would be a fun thing to do for a make and take. Yes, absolutely. It's easy. Um, Muriel said, Christian, I went to Thomas Jefferson High School in Brooklyn, New York. My children went to Thomas Jefferson Elementary School here in Roseville. How fun. Um, are you allowed to touch the cows? Are you allowed to touch the cows in your property, Deanna? If you want to get crazy and get close to them. <laughs> no. Are they wild cows? Are they gonna kick you or something? No, they just they just stand in the road and they just get in your way and <laughs> take our motorcycles. Around and I don't know. We just have fun with them. We're not mean to them, but you know, we pet them a lot. You pet them. No, we go moo. <laughs> <laughs> you talk to them. <laughs> yeah, we talk to them. We make them friend. We make them friends, right? <laughs> Why not? You know. Yeah. <laughs> Knock it over. <laughs> oh, oh, 
I think Lamont is from Queens. Do we have New York New York delegates? Because we're trying to form delegates in different areas. Like we have a Colorado, we have Washington. Um, so we're trying to form some delegation. Anybody from Queens close to Lamont? Because Gina is in Nevada, Reno, Nevada, but Maliza is in Las Vegas, Nevada. Mm. So I'm trying to connect you guys with other crafters in your local area because it's really, really, really fun to craft with each other. Carolina's Crafts is closed. Her PO box is Long Island. Oh, that will be a fun thing. Um, Muriel moved from Brooklyn in 1982. And Muriel is now in Washington. So are you guys going to form like a group together and craft together maybe? What part of Washington is Muriel from? I forget. Did she say? I don't think so. Muriel, which part of Washington are you from? I'm trying to remember the city it is. Near because kind of near Redmond, I think. But um, Cheryl, Cheryl is from Seattle area. Yeah. Oh, see, she's from Seattle. Yeah, we're all. Cheryl is from Renton. Home. Cheryl is from Renton. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, my sister and I are trying to organize a uh, crafty cruise. We might do it through Cruise and Crop, and so we'll let you know if we do. She has a bunch of people she crafts with in California. Oh, how so fun! We'll let you know where it's going to be and what the details are if anybody wants to join. Uh, we don't know. It won't be till like twenty twenty five. Not this we have lots of time. Yeah. 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 Um, is anyone from Mississippi? Anybody from Mississippi near Brian? I'm in Batesville and I don't know any fellow crafters any near me. We're going to make it. We're going to try to make that happen for you, Bri. We need everybody to have a crafty buddy that's local because it's funner. It's so much fun to craft with your friends, honestly. And be like, okay, let's meet in this craft store and we're just we're just gonna go to town. Because oh my god, when we meet, you guys, it's so loud. <laughs> <laughs> we're we're all talking at the same time. Stay said, Brian. We're a good five hours away. I'm in Louisiana. Brian, you have a semi local person with Stace. It's amazing to craft with a friend. I know you have a bestie. <laughs> Christian, did you show how to put the book together? Yes, I did. And these are the measurements to put the book together. Muriel, it is so easy. I promise you, you're going to be able to make it in 25 minutes or less. Yeah. Promise. Ask the lady. Sophia, if you go to her page about her, you can see her P.O. box address. Says Gina. Not sure. Spokane is ready. I, I know. I'm not sure Spokane is ready for us. <laughs> all of us together I in know. one table it's not like in one room you guys it is one table and i'm like oh that's gonna be insane that is gonna be so much fun um i'm trying to get sophia and renee to join us to the 2025 yes. crafty retreat because mm -hmm. That. Dude, that's going to make us 16 people. That The more, the merrier. And, oh my gosh, it's going to be. Sophia, okay. So these, this is the measurement for our um, Happy Mail book. It's good size. It's so easy. Renee is in, so we got 15. I'm waiting for Soph to say yes. That makes us 16, because we're 14 now. We're 14 now. I'm hoping Gina could come, because she's a very busy vacationing person during the summer. But if we make a reservation for Gina, let's say let's give it a, a year, maybe, Gina. <laughs> <laughs> join us guys it's open to every single person here please join us if you're able to it is in washington and it, we have so much fun it is we just go once a year 
um, they do have more retreats, but this is the box. This is the box that I have, and that's next week's retreat. It's the spring retreat called Over the Rainbow. Yeah. I'm so, so excited. I'm so excited. I'm going to give away all of the Over the Rainbow um, stuff that I made. I didn't get the I didn't get that one um you know for virtual but but it, it looked like it would be fun. It is so much fun. So much fun. I had to open it. And I feel like Over the Rainbow is such a beautiful collection like the colors it's absolutely glorious and magical. So I'm excited. I'm excited. So I hope you guys enjoyed tonight's live. We made this book. I promise you, this is the measurement. I have it in the screen right here. Please, please, please try it. It is so easy. Ask the ladies. Um, it's so easy. What does the arrow mean? Oh, the arrow. Oh, the arrow means that's where you score. So that means you score at eight inches. If you, uh, Muriel, review the live, Review the live because I, I show you how to score it based on your orientation. Hi, Raven. You got your virtual box. I'm so excited. Let's play together. I screenshotted it. Check out how we scored it because it is so easy. I promise you just check out the start of the video. Um, and then you'll be able to make so many of this to give away to friends and family if you wanted to. Um, I was surprised. I know. We didn't get, I, I was surprised. We didn't get any daily surprise goodies. Oh, we didn't. I have yet to open the box. So I'm really, really excited. Um, so I hope you guys can try it out. Look at that cow. Oh my God. So cute. <laughs> I'm going to do like a solo for Deanna to show her cows. Oh my God. They're so adorable. <laughs> Look how cute they are. And are you going to fill uh, fill your album with die cuts? I, I am, love it. I am with pigs. And then I also have that pig, which is pretty Oh, so cute. And look at the barn. Oh, my God. You're going to have a wonderful time tonight filling that book, my friend. Yes. And <laughs> I don't know. It's so, so cute. cute. So cute, so cute. And that. the chickens. Don't forget the chicken. Look at that. So cute. The chicken even has a cowboy hat on. Oh, my God. <laughs> You're so going to have a wonderful time. And they're tiny. I mean, once I figure out all the pieces, then I could throw them together pretty fast. Um, so, so fun. <laughs> they're so adorable. Forever. Okay. So. Let me look at Cheryl. Cheryl, show us your book real quick for the friends. And Lamont is saying Cheryl's shirt. Lamont oh, yes, loves the shirt God. that you are wearing. It's the print. <laughs> my leopard, it's a cheetah uh, print. My leopard print, yeah. Or cheetah. Um, let's see. I got to figure out where to put this rainbow. Anyway, uh, so there's my book. Darling. I love it. I love your flips. Added a few more things. Yep. Lots of flips. And tuck spots and flips. Ah, yeah. oh, what a great way to use the paper collection. It is. It's cute. It's so I, easy. I, I need to figure out what pictures to put in, but maybe some some Easter you know shots from yeah years past. Because yeah, that'd be great. Mm -hmm. Gina said. Cottage cuts dies are awesome, but you need to love paper piecing. Yes, yes. that's very, very true. <laughs> yes, you do, Gina. Totally. Renee yeah. and Renee and Soph are loving chickens and cows right now. They're in that <laughs> era of the the cows and the chickens. So I showed you mine already. This is my book right here. And the size of this, you guys, is eight inches. The height is eight inches in about five and three quarters, perhaps. Is it five and three quarters? Let me let me measure. I think it is. So it is five and five and five eighths the width. Mm -hmm. So it's a great size. 
it use you can put like five by seven photos inside it, it's it's so easy to make i promise you i just need for you to give it a chance and try this project at home and here is the measurement for that so um i would love it if you can give it a go and that is that is it for me tonight do you guys have anything else to add I just want to thank everybody for uh, subscribing to my channel. So uh, that that that's exciting for me. <laughs> and also, don't forget to subscribe to Diana's channel as well. They will be posting yeah. videos. Um, thank you, everyone, for watching. I hope you guys liked our super easy project for tonight. I feel like I want to make I want to make all of I'm going to make these in all of the collections that I have. I feel like it's gonna be so, so much fun and easy to do because you're just essentially using three sheets of 12 by 12. Thank you so much, everyone, and hugs to everyone. I hope you have an amazing weekend. This is Christian and... Deanna. Cheryl <laughs> and Cheryl. Yeah. Saying goodbye and thanking everybody for hanging out. Have an amazing weekend. Thank you, ladies, for joining the live. Bye-bye. Bye, everyone.